Before using the trimmer, be sure to dress suitably and wear the proper safety gear, such as standard work gloves, eye protection, closed toe shoes, and long-fitting pants. To reduce the risk of power failure or electric shock, be sure to use a proper outdoor extension cord that is in good condition. Use one that is heavy enough to carry the current your product will draw. An AWG size of at least 16 gauge is recommended for an extension cord 50 feet or less in length. The smaller the gauge number, the heavier the cord. An undersized cord will cause a drop in line voltage, resulting in loss of power and overheating. Extension cords exceeding 100 feet are not recommended. Be sure to always use the strain relief hook when using the tool to ensure that the extension cord does not accidentally disconnect. When dealing with tall grass and weeds, cut from the top down. Gradually cut into grass by using the tips of the strings. When cutting, be sure to not bury or force the trimmer head into tall grass. Maintaining a proper handle position will also maximize the trimmer's efficiency. Simultaneously keep a firm grip on both the rear and front handles. Comfortably hold the trimmer with the rear handle about hip height. Keep the trimmer tilted toward the area being cut and move the trimmer from side to side to avoid debris being thrown at the operator. Also, be sure to avoid hitting trees, shrubs, wood moldings, siding, and fence posts, which can also easily be damaged by the strings, as well as wear out the strings more rapidly. To advance the strings using the auto feed head, run the trimmer by holding down the trigger switch on the handle. Release the trigger to stop the trimmer. Wait two seconds and then press the trigger again. The strings will automatically advance. Be aware that the string will not stay advanced beyond the line cutter, which is there to maintain the proper length for the string line. To advance the strings manually, first disconnect the power cord. Push in the spool retainer button and pull on the strings. Be sure to pull the strings out to the line cutter. Make sure to only use 0.065 inch diameter monofilament string with this string trimmer. Additionally, if grass does become wrapped around the string head, stop the trimmer, unplug it, and simply remove the grass. For easy and proper edging, lower the flower guard into the down position. Rotate the handle and begin cutting. When the trimmer runs out of string line, there are two different solutions for replacing it. Either install a new pre-wound spool or take the current spool and manually load new string into it. 